Well, I, I really, I really, for I guess three reasons. One, to celebrate as a cancer survivor that it's been 14 years since my surgery and I've not had any, had any recurrence, so I celebrate. I think secondly, I really, to remember, to remember those close to me who we have already lost to cancer. My wife, uh, my stepmother, my grandmother, my best friend, and, and really the list goes on and on to a number of other uh, family members and friends. Pink has always been such a role model to me. She represents everything that a strong woman should be. Uh, she's the reason why I ran for student council president in high school. She's the reason why I applied to exec as a freshman here at Tech. I would love to see her in person and even love the chance to meet her. Within a six month period, two people in my life, my family friend, my uncle, were taken from cancer. The worst part about cancer for me is that there's not much you can personally do to help uh, rather than give a listening ear and a shoulder to cry on. I relay for my dad. Uh, right before I left uh, for Tech my freshman year, my dad was diagnosed with stage 3 colon cancer. Uh, he had 7 centimeters of his colon removed and he underwent uh, a lot of intense chemotherapy for a while the first semester while I was away. Um, and so I kind of found Relay as the reason why I wanted to fight and kind of fight with him. I think that having Pink come to Virginia Tech would be really impactful for this campus um, because when I think of Pink, I think of someone who's very strong and powerful and someone who is always willing to pick up um, for like a fight. So I think that she would definitely um, bring more awareness to our event and help us to get more people to come out to the drill field and support Relay for Life. It's the start of us waking up, come on. Are you ready? I'll be ready. I don't want control. I